It's been almost 20 months since the Boston Marathon bombing and more than 16 months since Johar Sarnayev was last seen in court. But Thursday, Sarnayev appeared in a Boston federal courtroom as the last step before his trial next month. All reports say the court appearance was brief and uneventful. Zanayev's lawyer asked once again for the trial to be moved outside of Boston. The judges denied the request before, but did not rule one way or the other Thursday. Zarnayev also approved the lawyers representing him. Zarnayev has pleaded not guilty to 30 federal charges related to the April 2013 Boston Marathon bombing that killed three and injured 260 people. The prosecution is seeking the death penalty. Reports say the courtroom was filled with survivors of the bombings. I want to be here not to see him so much as for him to see me, um, or to see us, and to see us all together. NBC's Pete Williams caught up with Boston Mayor Marty Walsh to ask him about the upcoming trial. I think a lot of people already say, okay, let's just get move this thing beyond so the families can have some peace. One unknown coming into Thursday's pre-trial hearing was the possibility of a plea deal for Sarnayev. But the Los Angeles Times writes there was no sign of a plea deal in today's proceedings. Nearly 90% of the case is sealed, making it virtually impossible to determine which side, the defense or the government, has prevailed in nearly two years of pretrial skirmishes. The trial is set to begin January 5th, with both legal counsels questioning a pool of more than 1,200 jurors. For Newsy, I'm Jamal Andrus.